Hi, I am Robert Ticiliano. I am a security awareness expert and the head trainer at protectnowllc.com. Welcome to this week's Protect Now Security Snapshot. Each week, we break down recent events in the world of scams, fraud, and identity theft. I will provide you with real life examples of how certain information vulnerabilities can be exploited by online predators, by the bad guys, and share the best up-to-date tips and practices on how to protect your business, your loved ones from hacks, fraud, and identity theft. Let's get at it. And welcome to this week's Protect Now Security Snapshot. So protecting your child's identity from child ID theft. That is a huge problem. As many as a million kids per year could be victims of this crime. Sometimes it's the actual parents that are doing it. Other times it's bad guys who get access to social security numbers on the web somewhere, or even at the child's school or hospital or other places in which it shows up. And then they use it to open up new accounts under the name of the victim, but they simply just change the age of that child from two to 22. In this week's security snapshot, I'm gonna show you a blog that I wrote and some tips as how you protect yourself. Also, we're gonna talk about uh, the credit parent child identity protection service that freezes your kid's credit real quick. Also, I was on Dr. Oz discussing the exact same issue, right? And then Massachusetts Realtors, pay attention, 8CE credits, gonna show you how to access that and get on our next webinar. Also, how to download uh, links, this file, a PDF, so you can access all these various links and to get a copy of my free ebook, which was a bestseller on Amazon. And you gotta like our Facebook page, I'll show you how to get our Facebook page. Let's get at it. Okay, so child identity theft, protecting your child's identity from identity theft. So the people who steal your kid's identity are those generally close to you, or it could be a complete stranger. So sometimes parents, especially estranged parents, those that might have financial issues and sometimes drug issues, will steal a child's identity. It happens all the time, like a million kids a year potentially affected by this crime. So it's important that you reduce that child's risk. So let's discuss that in this recent blog that I wrote. Uh, basically, uh, you know, did you ever get a pre-approved credit card offer for a child? That might mean that their identity has possibly been stolen. So what are the warning signs revolving around child identity theft? Basically, if you do receive a pre-approved credit card offer in the mail, that means your kid is in the mix of getting credit. That can mean potential fraud. Also, if you get turned down for government benefits, you might apply for something, a loan of sorts, uh, and put your kid on there. And the government or that lender may recognize your child as an adult. That obviously is a problem. Further, if you get a notice from the IRS, you know, taxes, uh, that is actually a real thing. And it happens all the time. Kids file a, a bad guys file for taxes under your child's name to get a return, to get that money and to cash it in. Also, of course, if you get calls from bill collectors, that is obviously a huge red flag. So how do you protect yourself? How do you make your child's identity useless to a thief? So basically, uh, unless it is absolutely necessary, do not share your child's social security number with anybody. But the reality of it is that's not really possible. You're going to have to uh, provide it to the IRS, to insurance companies, to doctor's offices, and on various applications. If you can avoid it, do so. But the best thing is to make it useless to a thief. We'll talk about that via a credit freeze. Also, lock away your child's info to keep it secure, either in a fire retardant safe or in a locking filing cabinet in your home or office. If you have documents with your child's information on them before you throw them away, of course, shred them. Also keep an eye on anyone in your home. Could be a babysitter, could be a contractor, could be a dog walker or a cleaner that might have access to any sensitive documents. And again, they should be locked up in your home. Also learn about any school information where, your kid, where the school might handle your kid's sensitive information and how they use it, how, who has access to it and how they dispose of it. But the best thing you should do right now is to freeze your kids credit okay so how do you go about doing that basically we created credit parent credit parent is a service that you can subscribe to basically it's a one-time fee 35 bucks to freeze your kids credit and that's across all three credit bureaus the credit bureaus don't make it very easy for um 
parents to freeze their kids' credit. They make it easy for adults to freeze their own credit, but not for kids. For kids, it's a very analog process. But what Credit Parent does is, uh, is facilitates the process of you putting all that documentation together and making it really easy for you to do so. Basically, go to protectnowllc.com forward slash credit dash parent. And from there, you click on freeze now. And essentially, it gets you to this page where you can start protection today for your kids. Once you log in, you take a bunch of pictures of some uh, identifying documents of your kids. It's really secure and it's fine. Go ahead and do it, 35 bucks, upload the information and Credit Parent works through the process of making it really easy for you. Further, I was on the Dr. Oz show discussing this exact same problem Watch the video. It talks about the problem, how bad it is, how much worse it's going to get, and what you got to do to protect yourself and your kids. Also, for you Massachusetts real estate agent, March 3rd and 4th, 2021, we're having eight CE hour classes over two days. It's under 100 bucks. Check it out. It's a really good class, CSI protection. And then if you want to get a copy of this session, all the links to all, via, via a PDF and a copy of my free ebook, go to protectnow.online. And further, you got to like our Facebook page. It is at facebook.com forward slash protectnowllc.com. That's all I get time for today. You guys are great. Thanks for sticking in there. And look at, be careful out there and wear your mask. Peace.